Hello everyone, this is Dawn and I want to welcome you back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. I hope everyone's having a wonderful evening tonight. So I'm here to do um, the video, well sorry, one of the videos, so I guess this would technically be part one, of what I got during the semi-annual sale Bath and Body Works. Um, so yeah, um, 90% of my, sh well, 95% of my shopping was done online. I went to a couple stores, but unfortunately they didn't have much. Um, they had a lot of 50% bins, but like maybe one or two 75% bins. And I promised myself and swore to myself um, that I was not going to purchase anything for 50% because last year I went a little crazy and spent way too much money on a lot of stuff that I really didn't need. Well, I guess do we really need any of it? Um, but anyway... So I figured if I couldn't find any 75% items, then I really didn't need anything at all. Not that I really needed it anyway, but I wanted it, put it that way. Um, so yeah, so like I said, um, a lot, actually most of it was done online. I did go to, there's four locations near me, um, and then we also have an outlet. And the outlet, I mean, I love that we have an outlet, like literally like a five, three to five minute drive. It's amazing. They have so much nice stuff and all year long they have like semi-annual sale prices, which is really nice. Um, so yeah, so there was a lot of stuff that I couldn't find online or in the stores, any of my other stores, but I was able to find, um, in the outlet, which again was really nice. Um, I used, uh, let me say, I had a, I think it was 10 off 40 and then I also, believe it or not, had a 10 off 30 that was in my app, um, and it was, like, expired. And when I mean expired, I mean, like, two weeks expired. And I didn't realize it, and so I looked at it right before I was going to give it to the guy to scan. And he scanned it, and guess what? It worked, so I was happy about that. Um, so, yeah, I didn't even realize it was in there, and I figured, you know what, I'm not going to waste it. If it works, it works. If not, oh well. And then... Um, I think it was like towards the end, they had a 20% um, through emails. Um, so yeah, so anyway, without further ado, let me just get into this haul. So, um, oh yeah, just a quick little, just real quick. Um, I really didn't need much, obviously, because I did shop throughout like, you know, November, December when they were having a lot of their amazing deals. They had like their body, um, their body creams were like $4.95 then they had their fragrance mist as well as their shower gels. Um, so I did have like mostly everything from the line. So I really didn't need, you know, a lot of that body care, meaning like the fine fragrance mist or the, um, creams. But I did want to stock up on the shower gels because unfortunately I only grabbed like one or two. And I had a lot from last year, from um, the semi-annual sale from um, June and July, from like a lot of spring and summer scents. So I really didn't have that many, you know, fall or winter holiday scents. So that's most of what I got. But all right, so let me just get into this haul. I'm not going to yap your ears off. So the first thing I grabbed was I got the um, Christmas Cocoa Mint. And these, um, I did get one online, and I grabbed one in the store, so I was good, glad to have that. And again, everything I'm showing you was 75% off, and I apologize for the glare. And you know what? Let me fix this lighting situation. Let's see. There we go. I'm so sorry about that. Okay. And then I did grab two of the body creams and the Christmas cocoa and mint. And the fragrance notes on this are decadent milk, let's see, de decadent milk chocolate, thin mint cookies, and marshmallow fluff. And again, that's two of the body creams. So let's just put these guys right here. And unfortunately, I was only able to find one of the shower gels. But again, that's all right. Um, I could always pair it with something else. It's not a big deal because we all know, I mean, I love their shower gels, especially their creamy body wash, but unfortunately, once you wash yourself, literally, once you're out and you dry, like, the scent goes away. So, again, that's Christmas Cocoa Mint. And then, sorry about that, everything's falling down, of course, like always. And then I have the Twisted Peppermint 
in the Fine Fragrance Mist. And I did haul this um, again in December. But I had a body cream left over from last year that I didn't even realize I had. And I must have got it. Well, obviously, I got it from the semi-annual sale. And I was not able to find the Fine Fragrance Mist. So I figure, you know what? I'll just grab another one and I can always pair it with that. And I did grab the shower gel, the Twisted Peppermint. And the fragrance notes on this are Cool Peppermint, Sugared Snow, and Fresh Balsam. And I really like this scent. Um, I know a lot of people were saying, and I also noticed it, this year it's much sweeter. Um, I don't know, it must have had a note in there last year and a lot of people were steering away from it. Um, but this year it is nice. And again, um, I can also pair the Christmas Cocoa and Mint with this because I did grab several of them. Um, I have probably about four left over from last year's packaging. And then I grabbed one, two... And then three of the Twisted Peppermint in the shower gels. And then I was able to find the Santa's Blueberry Shortbread. And in this line, there was actually five. They had the Hot Cocoa and Cream, the Bright Lemon Snowdrop, the Winter Candy Apple, and the Christmas Cookies. And they were all really nice, but to be honest, this one was my favorite. Um... Again, I love the packaging, and that's the Santa's Blueberry Shortbread. And these guys were literally flying off the shelf, so I was really happy to find this. And I actually found this one in a store. And then I also got the body cream for that, and the fragrance notes on this are Baked Blueberry, Crumbled Shortcake, and Whipped Cream. And again, this is just a really nice um, gourmand bakery with blueberry. Really nice scent. And then I also was able to grab two of the body wash. Okay. And then I grabbed the, well, I should say a backup of the hot cocoa and cream. Because again, last year I missed out on this line. Well, I missed out on the hot cocoa and cream. Um, so I definitely wanted to get backups because it is really nice. So there's the fine fragrance mist in that. And then we have the body cream, and I love the packaging. And the notes for this are creamy cocoa, mini marshmallows, and vanilla musk. And then I did grab two of the shower gels. One was purchased in the store, and one was online. And then I was able to find one of the Bright Lemon Snowdrop. Um, I did only grab one when I grabbed this line um, during the holidays. And I don't know if you watched any of my previous videos, but I go through shower gels literally like Carter goes through liver pills. I mean, I go through them extremely fast. Um, my husband's always saying, why do you use so much shower gel? You know... That's just me. I'm sorry. I will literally douse my loofah with, I, I don't know. I just, maybe I, I don't know. It's just, just me. I don't feel like I'm clean. It's getting me clean. I don't know. I just love it. So, um, I usually try to get at least two or three of the shower gels to, um, you know, a body cream and then a fine fragrance mist. And same thing. Um, I go through the body creams faster than I go through the fine fragrance mist. And that's because, and a lot of people can vouch for this. Fine fragrance mists literally seem like they last forever, which is a good thing. So, again, I'm noticing now that, like, I still have at least half of a bottle of, like, uh, any set, say, any fragrance that I'm using. Um, again, I try to, you know, use it as a set and layer it because it does last longer when you layer it. Um, so, I've been going through literally, like, the one whole big, you know, body cream, and I still have a half left of my body mist. So now I'm going to probably start getting, like, two of the creams per, um, per fine fragrance mist. So, again, that's the Bright Lemon Snowdrop. And did we go over the notes? I don't think we did. Okay. Let's see. That's me just yapping. I'm sorry. The Frosted Lemon Citrus Marshmallow Fluff and Vanilla Bean. And this literally just smells like one. You, you ever know them, um... I can't even think the lemon the lemon drop candies really really nice light scent not overbearing either like not a, none of these are offensive to anyone put it that way and then 
I would have liked to get a backup of this whole line in the Christmas cookies, but I mean, like I said, it was fine. I I wasn't able to find a five fragrance mist again, which is fine because I do, like I said, I'll go through two body creams <laughs> and I'll still like, and then maybe I'll get through a fine fragrance mist. So, um, um, Christmas cookies, and I know this was one of the popular ones. A lot of people, like I said, these guys were literally flying off the shelves and I was able to find this in store. And this is the creamy cookie dough, almond biscotti and caramel wood. And again, it's it's really nice, but I'll tell you what. And again, just maybe it's just me and my body chemistry. It is extremely light. Like you can put it on, and literally ten minutes, you can't even smell. It. So, but it is a nice a nice light set. And I also grab the um, the body lotion. Now, again, if you watch any of my videos, you'll know I don't I don't care. It's not that I don't like them. I just prefer the body cream because they are way more moisturizing and these really don't do anything. Um, I know a lot of people are saying they are a lot thicker and I do see that. But again, it's just not moisturizing. And in this, like in the wintertime, like I like have snake skin. No exaggerating. Like my skin gets so dry and itchy. So this just doesn't help any. But I actually grabbed this before I grabbed the body cream because I couldn't find it. And I was like, you know what? At least let me grab something in it. Um, again, so, you know, I don't have a half, um, a bottle of fragrance mist once I get through my first body cream that I purchased, you know, during the months before when it first came out. So I'm probably most likely going to give this, give this to my mom because she loves the body lotion because she don't like all the thick creams. So I figured that'd be perfect for her. And then I was able to find, uh, two of the Christmas cookies in the shower gel. Again, the packaging is gorgeous. Okay, and let me just move these down. And then, this is the Sugar Plum Swirl. And I actually grabbed this for my mom because she really liked this scent. So, and unfortunately, there's no fragrance notes on this, and I do apologize. But yeah, she really liked this scent. Um, So, I figured I'd grab her one of the fine fragrance mists. I actually couldn't find anything else to it. Um, and believe it or not, this was an online exclusive, I guess. It was only online, but I did, I was able to find this in one of the locations near me, so I just picked it up and grabbed it. And then, now these are all body wash. Again, I, like I said, I wanted to grab a bunch of backups for the body wash because I go through them quick. Uh, this is the Winter Candy Apple, and I grabbed one in the store and one online, and... I will read you the notes for this. Uh, let's see. The notes on this are red apple, winter rose petals, and fresh cinnamon. And again, that is the winter candy apple. Okay. And then we have the snowy citrus swirl. Again, a really nice scent. Um, this is chilled tangerine, whipped marshmallow, creamy tonka bean, and fresh vanilla. My opinion, this is not a winter scent whatsoever. Um, this is like more a spring or summer, but again, it is a really nice scent. It, um, it smells like, again, to me, like orange cream sickle. I love it. It is a really nice scent. So I now have a backup of the shower gel, which is great because this, again, these were really popular and they were literally flying off the shelves. So as you can see, I had to order mine online. <laughs> okay. And then... Gotta have Vanilla Bean Noel. So, let's see. The notes on this are fresh vanilla bean, sugar cookies, whipped cream, and snow kiss musk. So, I did grab two of these guys. All right. And then I did grab a backup of the raspberry sugar. And the notes on this are sugared raspberries, plum blossom with winter white lily. And that is raspberry sugar. And then we have the Mary Cherry Cheer. And the notes on this are maraschino cherry, pomegranate cider, and sugared musk. Let's just move some of this over. And then the snowflakes and cashmere. 
and the notes on this are cashmere cream, caramel woods, and frosted clementine. And to be honest, I never liked this scent ever. Um, I actually ordered, um, I ordered something last year um, when they had their SAS online, and they actually sent this by accident. And I don't know, like, I smelled it, and I was like, oh, I, I couldn't stand it. Like, it just gagged me. I have no idea. I don't know if it was the cashmere, because I'm not really into cashmere. Like, I don't know. Well, actually, does it have cashmere in it? Yeah, yes, it does. Crash cashmere cream. And I was just like, I, I can't. So I actually wound up giving it to my mother-in-law because she loves, like, anything with cashmere. But I was in the store, and I smelled it this year. And for some reason, I don't know if they put different notes in there or less of one thing, but I was like, wait a minute. Okay, I like this. So I actually grabbed a set, and I definitely wanted a backup of that. I'm sorry, a backup of that. I don't know. It's amazing. I, I guess maybe as you get older, your scent's like, changed I, I don't know and then we have the winterberry wander in the shower gel and the notes on this are um well, well sorry about that here we go red frosted winterberry sparkling cranberry and i'm so sorry it's because there you go and then let's do this over red frosted winterberry sparkling cranberry and crystal vanilla and again just a really nice scent Okay. And we're getting down to the bottom line to the, the last of it, but this is one of my like one of my favorites. I actually like this whole line. And this is the little black party dress. And this is frosted nectarine, black peony, and white patchouli. I love anything with peony. Again, this is just like a nice perfumey, sweet perfume, sophisticated set. Really, really nice. Um, so I definitely wanted to grab some backups. I was able, only able, unfortunately. I had three um, on in my cart when I purchased it. And then, of course, a couple days later, they canceled them out. And But I'm glad I was able to get one. But when I actually purchased this collection... When it had first came out, I did grab like three or four of them, so that's okay. And again, the packaging is gorgeous with the holographic. I love it. That whole line was really good. The whole line that came out with it. And then here's another good one, and this is Twinkling Nights. And this is Frosted Jasmine Petals, Whipped Vanilla, and Mandarin Blossom. So I grabbed one and two of the Twinkling Nights. And then here is my favorite of, I think, the whole line. And this is the Fresh Sparkling Snow. And this is Ice Pear, Frozen Melon, Winter Apple, Snowdrop Blossom, and Frosted Musk. I'm sorry, Frosted Musk. And again, this is literally my favorite. And it's just a nice, sweet scent. So I did grab one. Two, three, and so yeah, three in the shower gels, and then I was really excited to find this in one of the stores, and this is the moisturizing body wash, so, um, and I actually, when I, I think, yeah, when I actually purchased this line when it came out, um, I only grabbed the moisturizing body wash, I did not grab any of the shower gels, so, I would have grabbed more, but they only had one, and it literally was, like, buried. So, I had to, like, dig to the bottom, and it had all gook all over it. So, of course, I had to wipe it off. I always wipe my stuff off. I'll come home, and I'll have, like, disinfectant wipes, Clorox wipes, and I just wipe everything down. Because, I mean, you know, everyone's digging in there, and you got all kinds of fragrance mist. So, I'm sorry, mix. So, again, that's the Fresh Sparkling Snow. Okay, and then the last... Um, cause I'm actually gonna cut this off. I don't want this video to be super long. I was really surprised to find this. Um, now this is the, I don't know if you can see it. It's the, there you go, the warm vanilla sugar. And this literally was like one of my favorites, still is a favorite, but it is a light scent. Um, when I first started shopping at Bath and Body Works, um, teen years ago, Unfortunately, it was a long time ago. Um, uh, this was one of the first fragrances that I ever purchased there, and I love this scent. Um, so I actually found this, and of course, it is in the old packaging. And I mean, 
let's see, yeah, $14, because I think they're $14.50 now, $14.50, $14.50 now, sorry, speech impediment, um, so yeah, this is the old packaging, and this was 75% off, so I did grab that, and then I was happy to see this, this is the warm vanilla sugar in the creamy body wash, and as you can see, it is old packaging because now they actually come in, well, it's the moisturizing body wash, so they come a lot taller. Um, and I don't know if I read the fragrance notes to you guys. And as you can see, it is like an old packaging because if you look, the fragrance notes are all the way. Let's see, where are the fragrance notes for this? Come on. Oh my God, I know they have fragrance notes on this. Okay, there you go. If we can focus here with notes of, let's see. All right, I'm just going to read it. It's got notes of fresh jasmine and creamy sandalwood. So I was happy to find this. And this was 75% off. And then I did find it in the um, the regular um, body with a shower gel. So this was actually nice. And Actually, they had two of the Fine Fragrance Mist, and they only had one of each, so I definitely grabbed it. And I've seen a lot of people actually haul in um, the Warm Vanilla Sugar in the new packaging. They had the body scrubs. I would have loved to grab them. I have some. I mean, I had used them a while ago with rewards because I think they're sixteen fifty. Yeah, the cream, the uh, what are they? The um, the body scrubs. But I would have definitely loved to grab some of them. But it's alright. I was just happy to see this. Like I said, it is in the old packaging. But you know what? I didn't buy it just for the packaging. So, okay. So, that is going to be it. I'm actually going to cut this video down because we're already over 20 minutes. Um, and I do have some more stuff to show you guys. So, um, definitely look out because I have more videos following this from my um, semi-annual South Bath and Body Works. Um... If you want, I also posted a video yesterday of um, my Candle Day haul, um, so that was exciting. I did purchase a lot of really amazing fragrances, amazing scents on that, so definitely, um, you know, take a look at that. Click on that video um, if you like to watch videos like that. Um, yeah, so um, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I would greatly and highly appreciate it. Definitely subscribe if you want to see... Um, more videos of Bath and Body Works, different hauls, and if you like my content, and comment. You know, let me know if you shop at Bath and Body Works, if you shop at the Semi-Annual Sale, what are some of your favorite scents, and just so we can get to know each other. I love meeting new people. Um, you know, everyone has been so nice and awesome. Um, you know, I like to keep positivity on here. Um, so, yeah, so definitely. And I just want to, again, thank... All my subscribers, you guys are amazing, and as well as all my new subscribers, like, you guys rock. I am so grateful, and I do appreciate it so much. So, um, yeah, so that will be it from now. Like I said, I'm going to try and get at least one or two more out tonight. Today is actually Monday, so, um, because after that, um, I have, um, a huge collective haul from Victoria's Secret, and I am also going to do a haul from Walmart. Um, I got a lot of really nice, like, body care and, like, all kinds of cool stuff from Walmart um, during, you know, their clearance, you know, their end of clearance. Um, and actually, I think I just purchased one thing because normally they clearance like all of their Christmas stuff. I think the only thing that I bought from there was like, I actually bought a Christmas tree. I got a Christmas tree, like $200 Christmas tree for like $17. I was like, wow. But yeah, so I did grab a lot of cool things and they aren't Christmas, which is awesome. And like I said, they're body care items. So look out for that. So yeah, that's it. Um, so everyone, please have a wonderful, safe, and blessed night, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!